The following video contains information and video footage of an officer involved shooting with officers from the Macomb Police Department. The video is being provided to the public in commitment to transparency and public interest. It should be noted that the incident was investigated by the Illinois State Police and an internal investigation was conducted by the Macomb Police Department. The video and information contained herein does not draw conclusions on the actions of the officers or whether or not their conduct was in compliance with Illinois law and departmental policy. The video you see is taken from body-worn cameras. Body-worn cameras don't always capture everything the officer observes, nor do they capture what the officer was perceiving at the time. Conversely, body-worn cameras may capture moments that officers don't observe. Although these tools are effective in assisting with evidence collection, we are reminding the public that an incident cannot be judged based solely on what is recorded through body-worn video. Some video images have been redacted to preserve victim privacy, as well as victim names and addresses. At about 10.03 p.m. on March 16, 2024, officers are dispatched to multiple 911 calls, reporting an active domestic situation. One caller thinks they may have heard gunshots. Officers arrive within three minutes. Officers gain access to the east side stairwell and are met by a person who ushers the officers inside and points upstairs. Cold police, open the door. Huh? Cold police, open the door. Officers announce their presence and order the occupants to open the door. Huh? Officers hear screams for help. A distressed female subject could be heard yelling, he's stabbing me. Let's see your hands! Let's see your hands! Officers force entry into the apartment. A Macomb police officer discharged a single bullet. We will stop the video at this point out of respect for the deceased's family members. Following the discharge of the officer's firearm, the threat ended. Officers began rendering aid and called for medical personnel. Both the child and the suspect were pronounced deceased at the scene. We'll take a moment now to review additional details of the incident. When officers arrived on the scene, note the presence of blood on the walls of the stairwell. Cold police, open the door. After identifying themselves and ordering occupants to open the door, a female subject could be heard yelling, he's stabbing me. <laughs> Officers then force their way into the apartment after identifying themselves. The officer points their issued firearm at the naked adult male, identifies himself as police, and issues lawful commands to see the suspect's hands. Let's see your hands! Let's see your hands! The officer orders the female with injuries out of the home to safety. What happens next transpires in a matter of seconds. So we'll slow and stop the video occasionally for additional clarity and detail. Notice during the confrontation we can observe a knife in the suspect's left hand. We'll highlight the weapons when present as they're only visible for a short time during the incident. The suspect then lunges out of sight and a child is heard screaming. The suspect eventually reappears with a knife in each hand holding the child to his chest, one knife around the child's waist and one around the child's throat. It should be noted this adult male is identified as the suspect. A Macomb officer discharged a single bullet. The threat ended. Officers began rendering aid and called for medical personnel. Both the child and the suspect were pronounced deceased at the scene.